for? Joe Nemechek, oh, an 87 no. car. He Pow. wasn't quite as lucky. No, he was. Kurt Busch. He was flying through there, and the thing just got loose on him. And man, it went oh. into it went into a hard spin and into the wall. Yeah, the car just didn't rotate the rest of the way around, which might have kept him off the wall. You just see though, Larry, he he can't get the car to turn. Right in there, there's a kind of a turning point, and if you get past that, then you're in the loose stuff, and you get to the back end comes around. Yeah, definitely. Definitely hurts. I mean, this is uh, we have we have a few good race cars put together, but uh, that was the last thing I ever expected. I mean, it's slick out there. Just trying to make a qualifying run, and that was the first get up to go, and it just broke loose. I don't know. I don't really know what happened or why everybody's spinning out today. Oh, pal! Bad news for the Tommy Baldwin team as Casey Mears takes it hard into the wall. See what happened? Oh man, he got loose way, way back in the middle of that corner, and hits the end of that wall wow. right there. That's a hard, hard lick. I just what I'm telling you, Larry. These speeds, and I think that's one of the things that's getting these guys in trouble. Did he hit the wall, Kyle Busch? Night, I, I think, think he, he did. Smacked it. I saw a bunch of debris look like flying off the right side of the car. Water looks okay. So he was coming to green for his mock qualifying run. Let's see what happens, this bad boy. Whoa, it just took off up the hill and wouldn't yeah. turn. Red lights flashing because Marcus Ambrose has killed the right side of his car up in turn number four. There's your backup cars today, seven. And uh, only one in the last five races. Oh my gosh. And here are the Darlington Stripes today. And, uh, and again, a little asterisk, Dale Earnhardt Jr. actually got a stripe with his backup car as well in the 88. So he's a twofer.